Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. Super happy to see everyone here. Guys, for today's episode, so today is day two here in Hong Kong and we have decided to visit Citygate Outlet Mall. So we are going to check what we could find here. So day one was a little bit of struggle for me because I had difficulty in showing you the bags, but hopefully you enjoyed that episode. But for today, so this is an outlet mall here in Hong Kong, one of their famous outlet malls. So I'm going to see what they have and hopefully you enjoy today's episode. Hi guys, Ron here, Suking Budgetarian Fashionista. I publish vlog every Wednesdays and Saturdays about lace, about fashion. I do luxury shopping vlogs, hauls, and unboxings. I also do bag reviews and provide styling tips. I'm inviting you to please join our ever-growing fam. There's a cute little icon here, so please click on this one so you can easily subscribe and be a member of our growing luxury addicted family. Please like and share this video and help me reach my 4K subbies. Also, please do follow me on my new Instagram account that's at Ramirify2 for daily updates and styling tips. Alright, let us start our day 2 adventure here in Hong Kong. So currently, we are on route to Citigate Outlet Mall. This is the first outlet mall that we are going to visit here in Hong Kong. Please take note guys that Hong Kong has three outlet malls in total and I can't wait to share everything to you. Plus, on a positive note, I am loving the public transportation here. It's very efficient, it's very fast and very smooth. We could travel anywhere in Hong Kong. All right, so we have finally arrived in our destination. So as you can see, it's very easy once you drop off at your MTR station. It's the Tung Chung station. Here is the facade of the Citigate Outlet Mall. Just in case you are not familiar, it's such a big place here, guys. To be honest, you are going to enjoy once you travel and visit Citigate Outlet Malls. So let's check out. So let's go in. I'm really, really excited. After so many years, finally I'm back. I'm so happy just to be back here. Let's go upstairs. Let me know if you want. Si para mas kaganda yung mga stores upstairs. Ooh, Ferragamo! I wanna go there. This is... Wow. Very such. Oh my god, there's Burberry! Oh. I think parang this is like... Ooh, Max Mara! Oh my god!
after this plan 2040. 2040. And 40. I'm so happy that they now have their gamo here. So how beautiful are these vanity bags? So these are like the newer designs of their gamo from the first runway collection of Maximilian Davis, their new creative director. Discount for fourteen thousand nine hundred forty. That's the. It's this, uh, already discount. Yeah. That's a discounted yes. price. No yes. additional. No for additional. That one. Yeah, it's new model, you know. <laughs> because different colors, the price look uh, ah. be different. Yeah. These are thirteen thousand six hundred fifty. I see. But uh, you they have so many selections, guys. And please take note: everything is on sale. You know me guys, I do love Ferragamo. Currently in my collection, I have two. And I wouldn't mind adding another one to my collection. Just finding the right one. I am so in love with the studio bag, that one. So we have here a shoulder bag style with the Gancini logo. How chic is the Gancini logo, right? For me, it really is suited with the quiet luxury trend. This is, mm, this is 11. Yeah. This is 11. Uh, some, yeah, this time. 9,000. 9,570. So we have more Ferragamo eye candy. So they have seasonal and collection pieces and rare pieces like this one wow just look at the flamingo how beautiful is this colorway love this one caramel one i love the studio bag at the back so they also have bucket bags like this with studs you know me anything edgy that is a yes for me Next, let us check out Burberry. So again, this is the first time that I'm seeing Burberry here at Citygate Outlet Mall. So the very first one that I've seen is this very cute Burberry clutch price at 5,110 Hong Kong dollars. Then they also have this Sunny's sale price at 1,200 Hong Kong dollars. So Yen here is trying it on. And of course, guys, I have to check this crystal bag by Burberry for $21,350. How beautiful and how I love, of course, a good sparkly bag as you can see here. Although the thing is, if you're going to purchase this one, it may look dated because it's, this is from the Ricardo Tishi era. So let us check out the wind on display here at Max Mera. So we have checked out the quotes here. They also have very good items. They have very good sale. Then we went inside Versace. So first we saw this ring for 1,680 Hong Kong dollars. They also, I am loving this earring by the way. So we have tried this on. So this is the price. It's around 1,380. As you can see, it's very edgy and very unique. Oh my God. A 
then let us check out our money here at city gate outlet let's check the window displays first normally i am not a fan but upon seeing the bags i instantly fell in love with the new design especially that one the top handle red bag so later we are going to see more so this one so screenshot the price the price of this one the sale price is 12,250 I love a good tote bag and this is the bag that I'm in love with this brand so it's a top handled bag it's like a shopper tote and sale price 7,400 Hong Kong dollars then let us check out the IT city gate outlet so the IT here in Hong Kong they do carry different luxury brands from off-white from Marnie from Mark Jacob so this one is 2390 so this is the off-white that I fell in love with when I saw this one unfortunately this was the last piece but it has a good price of 5,000 HKD that is the sale price already so we have different brands so we have 4,499 we have Versace over here Jill Sander, 13000 after discount. They also have Alexander Wang pieces. So unfortunately, when I was filming, I accidentally hit the slow-mo recording so apologies guys but let us just take in you know the beautiful eye candies of this alexander wang bag so i think i'm seeing like a croc stamp leather over here and how beautiful is this mini shoulder bag with the alexander wang silver logo in front it looks like a jelly bag and of course this one this is a crystal bag if i'm not mistaken the brand of this one is rosantico then they do have a com de gasson paper bag that was transformed into a plastic shoulder bag as you could see here if i'm not mistaken the price of this one is less than 2000 hkd so let me try it on for you guys as you could see it's very huge so i believe cassie torp has this one but it's the gucci one that she has they also have footwear like this for 3600 hkd they also have ready to wear like balmain next let us check out diesel guys honestly when i saw diesel i ran inside the store so this one they do have the famous diesel bags the 1d if i'm not mistaken price of this one is 3430 hong kong dollars how cute is this one so the mini one guys i believe that is around 1500 hkd but don't quote me on that one so this one is a very special seasonal piece for 3990 hong kong dollars as you can see i'm trying it on here huh it's just three three four or three five Which one is better? The orange one or this? The orange one. I want it sana black eh, pero... Leather siya. Para mga... Pakumpit na 3-4. Mga 3-5. So, yun nabi. Very coach. Very coach ang ano, pricey. Mga kwait mo mga kwait. Gusto ko to, oh. My baby. Unfortunately, I was looking for an all-black 1D bag, but what they have here are seasonal and very colorful designs. 
Next, let us check out other stores. So they do have Calvin Klein. They do have Kenzo. Mark Jacobs. So let us check. So they have Mark Jacobs over here. But first, let us go inside Kenzo and see what they have. So here are the bags from their previous collection. So bags, shoes, ready to wear, they do have. So this one, so I'm checking out this bucket bag. The price of this one is 2,023 Hong Kong dollars. Then the price of this one, sale price is 2,195 HKD. How beautiful is this bright orange bag? Then let us check out Mark one, Jacobs. 1467. One, four, sale price. So Marc Jacobs are offering, of course, outlet pieces. This one, so it looked lovely, but when I have touched it, the leather is not good, guys, unfortunately. So I passed on this one. But they do have this very beautiful bag for 2,634 HKT. And now let us go to Coach, my favorite destination of the day. So the very first one is a Coach Bandit bag price is 3750 The sale price, that's Hong Kong dollars. So for the Coach outlet, guys, what I'm looking for are the tabby styles like this. This is 50% off, so sale price is 2278. So it's tabby top handle size 26. The coach CAs are saying that it's very rare that outlet stores would have coach tabbies. So just in case you would be chancing up any design from the tabby line, get it right away because it is almost sold out ASAP. Then they do have this very beautiful pillow Madison. Original price is four five, but sale price is two thousand two fifty. How beautiful is this lavender or lilac colorway? I think the size of this one is eighteen. Then they have like keychain bags. So this one original price is nineteen hundred, but sale price is nine fifty. That is fifty percent off. So I'm. Comparing it right beside my toiletry pouch 26. How cute is this mini bag? Then they have seasonal styles like this one. I am in love with this backpack as well. Then another pillow medicine for 2250. The color is chalk with the gold hardware. They have this beautiful Bandit bag original price is 4500 HKD, but it's 50% off. What do you think of this one? Again, this is another wear design that you would be chancing upon. The outlet they have a bigger size like this, I believe the size of this one is 26. As you can see, the tabby top handle they only have two currently in store. Then they have this tabby shoulder bag or mini bag, so original price 36, but sale price is. 1,800 HKD. Then they have a special section where everything is 950 HKD. Like this very beautiful jelly bag. Oh my god, this is really so beautiful. It comes with a 
wristlet style and can be worn wristlet or as a crossbody but and omg guys this robe 12 wow love 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 this one so this is the price 1450 hkt they also have the soft tabby so this everything here is priced at 1950 hkt that is already the sale price so here yen is currently trying on the jelly tabby that is a runway piece so is this one this is a special collaboration i just forgot the artists that they have collaborated with so here are other bags that you could find inside the store i am loving the turn lock the flower turn lock oh they have like the robe bags Next, let us visit Chloe. Yes, Citygate Outlet now has Chloe. The very first one is priced at They have this very cute bag for 2336 I was seriously considering this one because it really does remind me of the Bottega pouch bag and that is the style of the bag that I still currently don't have in my collection. Then we have here a top handle bag from Chloe. So the sale price of this one is 10,500 HKD. Oh, the strap though is non-detachable the strap is not detachable it's you mean removed? No, yeah it cannot be removed this. but for the bigger then we have also checked out furla at citygate outlet so how cute is this sequin bag the price of this one is around 3000 hkd very summery very spring summer they also have this very cute and fun bag dog bag how do you think then they also have this beautiful you know like tote bags like on the go from louis vuitton then we came by by another store that carries different luxury brands like for example this bottega veneta for 12k they do have alexander wang pieces so they also have jackie moose bag for 4000 hkd another alexander wang Hi guys, how are you liking our episode so far? So honestly, um, we've been to Citygate before. That was around 2016. So it's almost 10 years that we've been back here. And guys, OMG, I'm so surprised. I'm so blown away with the selection. And there are so many brands here that don't, wasn't here before. So like um, the Chloe bags, I'm eyeing the Chloe bags, the diesel bags as well. They're very affordable. There are also bags here. So the new brands like Ferragamo, I've shown you a very beautiful classic bag. So they have the Wanda, they have the studio bag. So let's see what we can find more, but hopefully you are enjoying our episode. All right, so guys, so actually I wasn't, I did not purchase anything yet because I wanted to check what other stuff that I could purchase here while still in Hong Kong, but we got this from Coach. So we are going to do an unboxing pretty, pretty soon. So I'm just ending this vlog right now. Hope you enjoyed our episode for today. So again, guys, um, if you have stayed until this part of this episode, kindly leave me a shopping bag emoji. I would really appreciate it. Thank you. So before we end our episode for today, I'm inviting you all to please join our ever-growing fam. There's a good little I can hear. 
So please click on this one so you can easily subscribe and be a member of our growing luxury addicted family. Please like and share this video and follow me on my new Instagram account that's at Ramir52 for daily updates and styling tips coming from me. A million thank you for staying with me in today's episode. I'm going to leave a couple of videos here for you to check out. Please stay safe and join me on our next Hong Kong vlog. Bye!